We're here at the White House for a screening of the uh, HBO film Thurgood. I can't say enough about the, the screenplay by uh, George Stevens, and it really tells his whole life in, a, in an hour and a half in a very creative and educational way. The law is a weapon if you know how to use it. And he was the architect of change in civil rights. Uh, and he used the law in the most creative way, culminating in Brown versus the Board of Education, the Supreme Court decision that outlawed school segregation in this country. That's a good story. There is one lesson that evolves from several of his commitments through life. First was a commitment to all of his clients and to represent them to the best of his ability and a commitment to serve the community in every way possible. One person can make a difference, but that that one person, though, needs a lot of people to help him or her out along the way. Whenever he spoke, he would always give credit to his mentors and to the ordinary citizens who risk so much to have their day in court. It's very special to have this event being hosted by our nation's first African-American president, who is also a trained lawyer. And so the, the connections to my father and his work are quite strong for us. The first time I met the state senator from Illinois in 2003 here in Washington, we stood and talked about Thurgood Marshall. You know, he, being a constitutional lawyer, was interested in him, and I was writing this play. So that sort of journey to hear where this movie about really one of the great Americans, Thurgood Marshall, that is quite a thrill. As we focus on today and focus on moving forward, I think it's so important, particularly during African American History Month, that we remember those who worked tirelessly, who sacrificed so much to enable us to enjoy the freedoms and opportunities that we do today, and my father was one of those.